welcome to today's vlog. I just got back from my workout class. I feel like I'm still trying to catch my breath. I've been done with it now for probably like 30 minutes by the time I like drove home and then I just ate breakfast and I still feel like so out of breath. It was so hard today. Yeah, that was my morning, but I always love starting the day. Going to a workout class, I have on this cute new outfit that's from Fabletics. They're sponsoring today's video. So I actually laid out some of my new stuff to show you guys. But right now it's 8.49 and we need to leave by 9.20. Taking Cove on a little outing today. We're going up to the zoo, which I don't think we've been there in probably like a year. So hopefully she will like it. She really likes animals and like elephants and everything. So we're going with my cousin and her kids and I hope that Cove loves it. But we've had like a really busy week. We've had like big activity. I feel like every day this week, like something going on and then we have something tomorrow. So I'm kind of like tired already and it's only like what? Thursday, but I think it'll be fun. So anyways, we're gonna go do that. I'll come back, show you guys my cute new outfits. I guess I'll show you guys this one in the mirror since I'm wearing it. Um, I'll talk more about the Fabletics pieces a little bit later, but I do have a link in the description. If you guys wanna get two pairs of leggings for $24 when you become a VIP, they have so many cute things. So I'll show you guys after we get back, but this set is super cute. I just got it. I have smalls and everything still. I need to get medium. I'm making it work for now, but tomorrow I'll be 29 weeks. So I definitely need a medium, but these pants are super cute and I'm really out of breath So I'm gonna shower really quick and then get in the car. It's like a 35 minute drive probably It's kind of far away. So I don't have that much time to get ready, but that is what we're doing today All right, Coco, we made it to the zoo There's some giraffes over there. Do you like to is see that them? Is that cool? She wants to go over and feed them. It looks like they're feeding them. Does that look cute? That looks way cool. Do you like the lions? Do you say rah? Those are so cool, huh? Are they beautiful? Wow, sis. I'm trying to get her to leave this thing for like three minutes. Do you like the lions? Yeah. Those are so nice. Aw, he's so sweet. Snack time. What'd you get, Coco? I got Dippin' Dots. Parker got a pretzel. That is a good pretzel. That's a really good pretzel. It's Look definitely how worth whatever $7 we paid for. It Dippin' Dots is always my favorite. Cookie dough, though, not cookies and cream. Cookies and cream is also good, but cookie dough is the best. I and mean, I like to let it melt just like a tiny bit. Parker just waited in line for at least like probably 10, 15 minutes. He had to like get out of line, get a ticket, and get back in for the merry-go-round. Cove was acting like she was really excited for it, and then once they got on, she was hysterical and she did not want to ride it. Oh, are you giving it to dad? Saying to your dad, dad? All right, last stop of the day. Right, at the zoo. We're at the cage. Yeah. Are you having fun? Yeah. 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 Wow. We're back from the zoo and somebody fell asleep in the car. So that means she did not nap at home. Usually she naps at 12, but most of the time I can like put her down later and she's fine. So I was gonna put her down at one when we got home when she fell asleep on the drive and she's not a baby who can like fall asleep in the car and then go to her room and like take another nap. She did lay in there for like 20 or 30 minutes cause we obviously like tried to put her down and then she was awake and wanted to get out. <laughs> so Parker is at lunch with a friend and I had some work to do, so I'll have to see what I can get done with her. I just put on this cute new outfit from Fabletics. So I'll try my pieces on in just a second to show you guys my other pieces. But this is definitely gonna be my new go-to sweatshirt. Obviously it's my favorite color. Plenty of room for my bump. And the inside is like super soft. And then I just have on these comfy gray shorts, so. We're having an easy lunch today. You helped make your sandwich, huh? That's so awesome. And you had an orange and some veggie straws. That's yummy. Okay, for my lunch, I decided to make a BLT. Parker has been on a BLT kick lately, so I actually got some new vegan bacon the other day that I haven't tried yet, so I just cooked it. I don't think I've ever made a BLT before. This is the bacon that I got. I'm pretty sure I've seen this at Target. I got it from somewhere else, but I have my bread. I usually have vegan mayo, but I don't have any, so this isn't really a vegan BLT, but okay, I just want like a tiny bit of that. Putting my lettuce, which I don't think we stored it very good in the fridge because it's not crispy. It's like very floppy. Tomatoes, the bacon, I just cooked it in a, okay, I burnt this for sure. It's way too crispy. That tastes very real. I feel like vegan bacon is really, like good vegan bacon is really hard to find. It's just actually vegan. I don't know if I've ever tasted more real tasting 
vegan bacon. Here it is. It'd probably be extra good if I hadn't burnt it, but that's okay. And I'm gonna cut it, test it out. Not bad. If anybody's tried this, let me know. This is good. Okay, Parker's home, so I can finally try these on. I'm excited to try on this one next. It's a romper, like a one piece. Okay, I love this one. I was worried it wouldn't fit because like I said, I got a small and everything and everything fits, but next time I definitely am gonna need to get a medium. This fits so cute. Literally cannot even tell that I'm pregnant from the front, but I love this. It's the Roxana Sculpt Knit. I have the link down below, but if you guys don't see any of these styles yet, Fabletics launches new pieces and styles every Thursday. So if anything's not up yet, it should be up on one of the Thursdays this month. So make sure you guys sign up and check that out so that you don't miss anything. And this is my final outfit. I actually took this one on the trip we went on last week when we went on a hike. Super comfy. I love matching sets because you don't have to think about what to wear. You don't have to like pair different things together. It just goes together and it always matches. So I have on these leggings. I love the material of these. They're super comfy. Matching bra. And then they also have this cute jacket that's like a matching similar print too. So this is the back. So it's nice. You can like adjust the straps and everything. Back of the leggings. I'm also sitting down to tell you guys the rest of this because trying these on has taken all my energy. <laughs> That's where I'm at in this pregnancy. But I do have the link down below if you guys want to sign up to become a Fabletics VIP. There are so many perks. A couple of them include the new Fabletics Fit app, which I need to check out. I'm excited about that. I love fitness apps. VIP members get free access to workouts. You can also now buy online and pick up in store, which is really nice. You get access to exclusive collections and you also save up to 50% off every day. So I do have the link down below if you guys want to check it out. It's easy to sign up. You go on take a style quiz. You can skip any month. There's no additional cost to be a member. No obligation to buy every month. You get exclusive access to collections and you just basically get like a ton of different savings. So the link to that is down below. If you guys want to check it out, I highly recommend that you do because it's the best. Literally most of my pieces, my workout pieces are Fabletics and their stuff lasts forever. I love it. So thank you to them for sponsoring this video. The next thing we're doing, I'm so excited about. I've wanted to do this forever. I bought a labor simulator that I saw on TikTok and we're gonna see how this goes. We're gonna use it on Parker. I unfortunately cannot use it, obviously being pregnant, and I wanted to be able to use it on myself to test out if it feels like what labor feels like. So the other day, Parker's sister was actually here and we used it on her and it was inconclusive if it like, just the whole experience basically. I think I need to mess with some of like the settings and stuff a little bit more, but I saw this specific one on TikTok, so I'm gonna put my other outfit back on really quick and then I'll show you guys and we're gonna try it on Parker and just like see how it goes. I wanted to do this last time I was pregnant, but I couldn't find a labor simulator. I just got it on Amazon. When did I buy this? May 27th, forever ago. We've been meaning to do this. Okay, so it says muscle simulator. That's like what they're all called. So I don't know, but we're gonna try it on Parker and see if it hurts him. Okay, so here is the exact thing that I got. I have to say, I think all the videos that I've ever seen like this are fake, don't you? Like they overdo it, you mean? Like they overreact. They'll have like a girl, yes. like the wife or whoever. And she's like, oh, that's nothing. And the guys are like, oh. And the guys are like dying. Yeah, I, th I think they're fake. You know, with my sister and my brother-in-law, both of them were like, it just tickles like it's over an overwhelming tickle but we didn't like do that much right. to like mess with it and see so don't fake your reaction this is a I'm real not, i will not fake. I, like i'm gonna try my best to just be like let just be normal you know okay i think i'm pretty good at so that. you have to put it like kind of low on your stomach so it has these sticky pads that you put on okay so i tried to read the instructions but like i said this is a muscle simulator or stimulator, stimulator. which I'm like saying i remember in high time. school we would like for football and stuff we, we would go to our trainer's room yeah and he had one of these but it was like a big thing yeah and it like helps your muscles so right? it's not actually like a labor simulator. no it's not a labor simulator but like it, simulator, it tenses up simulator. your muscles like so this is this is what the instructions look like it's like oh if you put it on your arm or your foot or whatever so that's why this is not that helpful turn them both on i wish i could use it we're gonna put it on me is it fine to put it on with my leg not or something? on your yeah on your leg not on your belly but yeah we i'll could. try one on my leg or something just like for the heck of it but so I i've got both of them turned on to a four don't turn it up. We're gonna turn turn on a, one of the settings first and see how it is, then Should we can I, turn okay, it up. Okay, I'm gonna click massage. Do you feel something? Yes! <laughs> 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 oh, 
Does it hurt? No. Ah! Wait, I didn't think you were going to actually do anything. How do I turn it off? I thought you were going to have no reaction at all. It's just like dancing up, but like it's like a vibrate. Like it tickles. Ah! It's like you have it on pulse, so it's like. Why did it Haley react like that? <laughs> Parker's sister said it was like nothing. I'm on four and I can go up higher. <laughs> I thought this was gonna be like a stupid video because I didn't think it was gonna do anything and I thought the reaction would be boring and I like felt bad but we wanted it's to It's definitely it. not painful, but it's like I can feel my muscles just tightening <laughs> and then like vibrating and tickling. Try oh. on a different button. Click what one did you push? I pushed a massage. <laughs> it's like, <clears throat> let's try knee. I'm not kidding. It just tightened your muscles. That's what a contraction is. Right. So yeah, I can see like what you're feeling. Like that pain. Let's put it on your leg. Do you want to crank it up? Oh, you turned it up. <laughs> okay, wait. I'm going to turn him up. No! I'm scared. Ate him. Oh! <laughs> it's weird. No, I can't do Oh my god. Okay. What the heck? <laughs> I'm not kidding you. This is real. Take well, those. Put it on one of my legs. Hold these ones. Oh, that was a, that's like an ab workout. Or lay back where I just was. Okay, don't do it too high. I'm scared. Don't be scared. Just be ready. Keep this. it on like one. But ready? You want me? What number? What's a good number? Ow! See? It's shocking me. It's not. It's like a vibrate, like tickle. That doesn't feel like labor at all. If that was on your abs. Okay, that's not a good one. Are you feeling that? Yeah. Ouch. You're, it's that weak? Ow! Okay! <laughs> okay, turn it off! Maybe it's different, it's like a tingle. Exactly, that's how it was for me too. But it's like a, a tightening of the muscles. I guess. Oh wait, let's do hand legs, see what this says. Is it doing something? It's like... Okay, is it hard? Okay, ouch! Ow! Okay, okay, that's enough! <laughs> I guess it's obviously way different on your leg than it would be like right here. So maybe it probably could feel similar to labor. Ow! Okay, ow! Okay, no more! I don't want it anymore! Well, okay. It well, that was good. I really thought that was gonna be boring because I thought that it wasn't gonna do anything. I wanna try it like on my calf and like see how it feels. I could see like if you're really sore, like your legs are sore, how this could be beneficial. My legs are sore and I don't know if that was really beneficial to me, but. Oh yeah, okay. This is a way different feeling. Really? It yeah, it just feels more like like you know those those pens or the like fake gum that you yeah, call Yeah, that's you? what it was feeling. That's what this feels like on my leg. It was a much different feeling on my belly. Really? Yeah. I wish I could try it. Whoa! <laughs> that started to like almost make my calf cramp. Oh! Wait, okay, can you put two of them on mine? Ow. Yeah, it just feels like one of those shocking pens. You need them all for. Wait, put it on the no on the other side. My calves always hurt so bad after I run in my so workout class. This. Do it not hard. Oh. I'm scared. Is it doing anything? No, literally nothing at all. What the heck? My whole leg is moving. Look at how your leg's tightening and then releasing. That actually feels really good. Right? That's <laughs> what I'm saying. My legs get they hurt so bad on my workout days. Why is it getting bigger? It's just you've t it's tightening your muscle. It's flexing your calf. Oh. That feels good, keep doing it. It says you're supposed to use this for like 15 minutes a day or it doesn't help you. That's I'll fine. link this if anyone wants to try. Or if anyone has tried this, tell me if it feels like labor because I can't test it. So what do you think? I mean, I don't know what labor's like, laughing? but it definitely like, I didn't even go to the highest level on my belly. Probably would have made me like be in a lot of pain and want to just like roll up into a ball. It does hurt. Okay, well that was fun. That was fun. All right, next stop is the store to pick out some flowers. We're gonna pick out flowers because my mom gave me oh, like it was, flower pots. Oh, it's been pots longer, but yeah, she gave us flower seeds. pots and well, seeds. Well, just pots to plant flowers. And we've been we 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 planted them like right when we got them. We've been watering them. We haven't very... watered them enough. That's why they so haven't grown. So the, the sprinklers get them. 
Oh, really? I set them in the right spot, so they're watered every day. Oh. Yeah, but the one flower just sprouted like yesterday or the day before, and it's like one little flower, and there's actually some weeds that have grown like in the pots too. It's been like four months of us just watering it, and we're yeah. like we're trying to give Cove like the she likes idea to go out and of water like them. watering it, and it grows, and then it comes. So I think we should go home and water it, and then tonight we can plant the other flowers and then show her in yeah. the morning. So, yeah, so that's the, the idea. We're gonna buy flowers that are like fully grown and we're gonna plant them in there. Sleeping. She sees it's like, oh, we watered them for six months and now they're grown. I wasn't gonna bring the dog, but she thought she was coming. So we're not going, well, Parker's gonna go inside to buy them, but Luma well, gets to what, come what on the outside of the store. this purple one? Coco, what ones do you wanna pick out? You wanna pick out some plants? Okay. Mm. Mm. This one? That yeah, one? This one? All right, we got one. Do you want to pick out one more? One more? What one do you want? Let's go, Luma. You've never been to a grocery store, huh? Hey, you're going to go buy it with Dad. Epic fail. We got here and we realized neither of us have our wallets, so we don't have yeah. money. And I went in and asked if they took Apple Pay. And they don't? No Apple Pay. Normally, we keep like cash in like each a, car. Like a $20 yeah, bill? Yeah, like a 20 or something. Our cash is down to like four $1 bills. Mm. So we've used it. I'll come back. So yeah. Okay, so that entire trip was a flop. We came home to grab our wallets and then I was like, oh, we should go to Harmon's because they always have cuter flowers. So we went to a different grocery store. They had literally nothing. So we didn't get anything because we didn't want to go back to the first store again when it's already like 5.45 and we just got back and it's time for dinner and blah, blah, blah. So we'll do that another time. But for dinner, we are trying out a new recipe. I want to make like fresh spring rolls. So I got got um i found this pinterest pin i don't really need like a recipe because you kind of just like make up your own but basically i got these and i've never used this before so it says you just soak it in water for a few seconds and then you basically just put veggies in it so we're gonna do that i also have this sauce that i've been wanting to try from thrive market i bought this but didn't know what to eat it with i was gonna do like a homemade peanut sauce this is an almond sauce so I think it will taste pretty similar. Another okay, bite. I got everything chopped. I have mm. cabbage, cucumber, peppers, cilantro, and carrots. Mm. So I think you can kind of put like anything in these, like I said. Then I have this. I have my bowl of water. How long does it say to Wait, soak? Wait, are you sure this is it? Yes. It doesn't feel very soft. They're supposed to get like stretchy. All right, I'll start with some cabbage, some carrots. Cove's over here just like eating an entire bell pepper. Some peppers, some cucumbers for mom, and some cilantro for mom. Okay, and then I think, oh, now it's getting stretchy. I didn't really watch the instructions on this part. Oh, you didn't? <laughs> but I think you just like roll it. I don't know what else you would do. But roll it tight. Nice. Look what mom made. I want to try one. And then you dip it. Oh, in. it's ready to eat like that? Yeah. Mmm. How is it? Mmm. Is it? It's good. All right. I'm gonna lay it down. You started with cabbage, some carrots. I'm gonna try and make mine longer and skinnier. Wow, this is hard to grab. How'd you grab that? Long uh -oh. and skinny. There it is. Let's try it. Coco, do you want some rice? Very fresh. I gotta work on my folding. This was not. This was not good. Oh, it broke. Mm -hmm. Fast, easy dinner. That was really fast. All right, guys. That's it for the day. We're gonna sit here and watch some of the Olympics. Thank you again to Fabletics for sponsoring today's video. You guys can check out the link down below if you wanna get two pairs of leggings for $24 and all the other VIP perks. Seriously, you know, Fabletics is the best. I got, one of the times I got, oh, yeah. I got some package. stuff and I'm a little uh, hurt that you guys haven't sent more Fabletics. So make sure you guys send some guys stuff next because honestly it's my favorite workout stuff that I have. But. Anyways, that's all for the video. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you thumbs up, subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.